when we talk about disability inclusion um, uh, in general, we're talking about people with disabilities and their challenge and uh, their pot the potentials that people with disabilities have. So uh, to be inclusive of persons with disabilities or uh, to embrace diversity, we need to observe our environment first. We need to observe what's going on around us. Uh, we might have friends with disabilities, we might have family, and we might not know how to uh, create a, a friendly environment for them. So I encourage people to get to know those people that uh, have disabilities. Don't just assume, but get to know that person and ask what kind of support they would need. And uh, also, uh, don't put the blame on the individual, but put it on the environment because it's the environment that's not inclusive. The individual uh, is not at fault. It's the environment that's not including that person. There's this uh, famous saying that I, uh, that I love. Everyone is a genius, but if you judge a fish by its ability to climb a tree, it will uh, uh, spend its whole life thinking that it's stupid. So we all, uh, we all have environments that we function in. A fish does not function outside of water. Uh, and someone that could climb a tree cannot function inside of water. So uh, we should always uh, create that opportunity, that environment for people to show their potentials and uh, to get empowered and to be able to, comp to contribute to their communities. So I would say, look out for the people around you, be observant of your surrounding and try to learn more about that person. Don't just assume because there is diversity in disability. Not all disabled people need something or want something. So be mindful of that. And just uh, recognize the fact that people with disabilities have normal needs like everybody else. Uh, they go to school, they get married, they go to work uh, in the normal circumstance. So we should be able to provide that environment um, as of rights.